Hello and welcome to another video. Press start. It's Crush Bandicoot 3. Crush Bandicoot Warped. Let's go for another video. It's the game I've not played so much. It's a good game. Don't get me wrong. I'm going to do a 15 20 minute video. Let's see how far we can get in this game. Uh, I recently did the Crash Bandicoot 2 game and nearly did the first walkthrough. I have not played this game as much as you have, so I have no clue really how to do it properly. So I'm going to fail. Hopefully it's going to make up for the fact that the Italian job game sucked awfully. <laughs> Wumpa fruit in the background. Free. No, Growing. it cannot be. Evil, great evil has come. Yeah, they have locked. Oh, no, there's not. I thought it had locked him out. She leaves a laptop out there. None have dared to fail to break Uka Uka even once. But you, Cortex, you have failed me twice. Great. Uka Uka, it was that infer bandicoot. From deep inside my temple prison, I sent you simple instructions to follow. But you lost the gems, you lost the crystals, and I have lost my patience. There is now no other power source left on this planet. I know we've had a few unfortunate setbacks and failed. But since your bumbling has managed to set me free, I am feeling generous. There is still a way for us to amass the power needed to enslave this miserable planet. And this time, this time the great Uka Uka will make sure that you do it right. After many eons, my evil twin Uka Uka has been freed from his old. underground prison. Long ago, I locked him there to protect the world from his malice. Now, free once again, he must be stopped. That's a small so, house. Uka Uka and Cortex plan to use this time twisting machine to gather crystals that lay scattered across time. <coughs> I have brought you here to recover the crystals before they do so. To open the time portal, simply stand on a button and then jump into the portal. It tells Good you how. Luck. I loved PS1 games so much. Just so so simple. And the crap quality graphics. But that was what was epic about it. And yes, I've said in many videos, there is black bars down either side. That's so I don't need to stretch and Watch the graphics and my controller just gone off because it's been left so long. Okay, so these are the warps. Toad village. This is Tiny's warp area. I'm sure we destroyed him. <coughs> crash, crash, crash. Why must you always muck in my mud? Oh look, I have a mask helping me too. We will find out which one is more powerful soon enough. Well, okay. I liked the original swap rooms where it came down in a projection. I thought that was really cool. Whereas this, I don't know. I'm not too happy about it. <laughs> Oh, I like the song. I think I also uh, did a video on this game too. But I can't remember. What? Okay, fine. You can't get those chickens, I don't think. I've tried. Even if you can catch up to them, you can't harm them. 
And I can't get over that, what the fuck? I can't be bothered with that. I love the level design, I mean, it's very fun. Look, look how far it shows me to the distance and the size. The other one it didn't, it just did not bother. It's still the same level. Uh, still the same uh, system, yet they improve the way it all works. That shot me in half. Let's get that. I'm going to go. Ah, relaxing. Because I'm a bit sitting on top of the desk now. And it's not going to help. What's going on there? Okay. I got caught on nothing. I seem to be on the castle. I love the music. Crash Bandicoot music is the best. Can I? No, I can. I can. I just love the music. It's so thought out. Others use proper music. This is just eight bit style. They didn't think, oh, let's just give them some random track with orchestrated. Let's give them 8-bit, just epic music. <coughs> they did not skimp on making this an awesome game. Same with the other one. They just didn't skimp. Why just churn out a sequel and make it crap? No, you can't go in there. When you can make churn out a sequel and put effort into it. They put a lot of effort into this game. Okay, you do that, and you can get rid of it. I can't remember this part. I kind of remember you finished up the castle over there. And that's cool how they played it like that. I don't know how they did it. I think they just warped the image and let the PS1 derp out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I could dance to that. Now for two. Oh, this is underwater. I hate, and I repeat, I hate the underwater ones. You can get the Game Boy version of this game, and it's just 2D. But they did it so well. I don't know if it's the exact same or whether it's slightly different, it's like Crash Bandicoot Adventure or something. So, square makes you shoot off. Oh, circle does. Okay, this is a bit more forgiving than I remembered. Normally, you just can't get past stuff by killing them. Way. Yeah, I don't like I said, I don't like these underwater ones. The controls are so floaty because of it being underwater. Puffer crash. Um so floaty from being in the water. You can't accurately control and I didn't mean to want to do that. So, yeah. 
I didn't really play this version as a kid. I only ever played Crash Bandicoot 2. It's the only game uh, from the franchise I actually played. I went backwards. Can I get it? the other game I've played not played this as much so I have to think ah that's cool so I have to go quiet like I just have think about what I'm doing. Otherwise I just down there but I'm not going to even think about chancing it. quiet through that few minutes. I don't like levels where I have to sit and think so much. It just don't bode well. Okay. Oh I see he fell over. I forgot about that. If it's not Crash who's supposed to be playing that level, he just flops on his face and then his sister takes over. Or oh, I hope it's his sister. I might come on a bit do it. Oh, I remember. I love this level. Yeah! Yes, you are. I've already failed getting the boxes, but I'm playing it because I can. Oh, I'm in China. They reused a ton of the sounds. That's why they were able to make the game probably make the game so soon. They're probably working two hours at once. I don't know because it tends to be the PS1 didn't last too long before the PS2 was out. So a lot of franchises, by the time they had made the first game, the PS2 was already out. So, 
I don't know how they managed to get three games now on the PS1 for the Crash Bandicoot series. Because by then, PS2 would win it. I sneeze. Oh, apologise for that. I sneeze, close my eyes, and carry on playing the game. That is not fun. And I hate sneezing because it drops up my nose sometimes. Oh, that was a life lesson. I don't know what he's doing. Is he weightlifting? I did not expect that. I did not notice that. Because I. Oh, that's cool. Okay, I thought it was an obstacle. Yeah, nailed it. Oh, nice. This is really thought out. Right, what shall we do for this level? And one said, why not run the Great Wall of China? And here we are. This is awesome. And you can see it waiting. Which is kind of cool. I like the fact you can see what's coming up ahead rather than it appearing from the other part of the wall. Oh, I nearly had that as well. Get life off him. She's got a laptop. What kind of person wins a laptop to ride on the tiger on the Great Wall of China? Who? <laughs> it's been 20 minutes nearly already, Jesus Christ. It was only 14 minutes, 13 ish minutes, a second ago before me. Till I sneeze and. Orient Express. So cry. I yeah yeah yeah. I remember this. Uga Uga and Cortex want tiny get crystals and bring them to Big Colosseum in Rome. Crash! Leave them for tiny, or crash get crushed. Oh, that's not tiny. Barney? Did he say Barney or did he say tiny? It sounded like Barney. Who's Barney? <coughs> oh no! I'm worried that something's gonna come out of there. <laughs> yes, there is. Okay, that was not fair. I did not expect that. I'm a bit shocked by that. I just hit the desk in shock. Oh, that's cool. And that's not cool. Okay. Can walk into the lava. So if I'm not careful, I just walk into it. Oh my god, he's putting his head down because I'm getting closer. I think it's cool that he waits there. Just to take my time. Oh, then it goes into the 2D, where I can go do all this stuff. Alright. And 
then it's full. That's really cool. They've gone between running backwards, running forwards. What the hell was that? Running forward. That's not nice. I don't like that whatsoever. Okay. So. It's in. Okay. That's not fun. So they went between the three modes or whatever. Oh, okay, I missed that. I'm sure the controls are way faster in this version of Crash Bandicoot. Because I'm able to jump way further and go faster than I want to. Oh! I'm determined to get that line. Yeah! Right, okay. It's coming to 20 minutes. I need to try and finish this level, then end the video there. So, it's a cool game. They did well. It's, it really makes a change from the subtlety. Oh, we're going sideways. Going makes a change from the subtle. Crash Bandicoot 2, where you're running through what appears to be like the tropical areas. And then there's the sewer areas. But with this one, it's all over the place. I know what's through there. Oh, and the, the, the grass as well, and him. Oh. And he... I'm not getting a single box, am I? Oh, I might get one of those boxes. From 64 to 66. And I bet there was something just back there. Oh, that sneeze has really got me. <coughs> anyway. I'm checking I've drank all my tea. I will finish the video here. I thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I made it for the failure of the Italian job, which I'm still annoyed at. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, hit like. And if you want, leave a comment. Thank you for watching, goodbye.